here, Happy New Year, Merry Christmas and all that. Basically, I haven't been on my YouTube for absolutely ages. Well, since my birthday. So, um, to start off the new year, I've got myself a rug, as you can see. Do you like it? Gel? Cool. I've um, wanted to basically do an unboxing video. Now, I've never done one of these before. So, please, please, please look after me while I'm doing it. And what we'll be unboxing today is... <laughs> These. Now, as you know, everyone is obsessed with the Dre Beats headphones, and I went and copped myself some today. So, um, should we go ahead and start unboxing? So, um, as you can see, they're really cool. They've got like every single language on the side, and the front, and the back. And it opens up kind of like quite cool as well, like like a booklet. But there's not much information here for like all English people, which is mainly other languages, so don't really worry about that. But it does actually, what it does say actually, which caught my eye was, this control talk thing. Um, basically, you've got like a play, pause button, power button, all this sort of stuff on the actual headphone lead. And it's um, compatible with your iPod, iPhones and iPads and your Blackberries, which is a plus because they're the only two main model handsets that everyone's busting around nowadays. So, this is what the box looks like. To be honest, I actually love the box more than maybe the actual speakers inside. It's got this nice sort of like plastic, um, sort of like tightened cling film over it. So that's just, you know, it's not good for kids, obviously. So let's get rid of that now. Oh boy. So once you've removed all that shit, <laughs> you now have the box itself. And to me, it looks like a drawer kind of thing, like you can, or maybe, not. no, 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 no. Wow. Oh, oh, so everything's falling apart, so <laughs> takes it, oh, let's take it easy here. Okay, now everything's falling out, so I'm just gonna lay it out and show you. Now, it's opening up, and we have all the, like, have a problem with your headphones, our customer service team book, <laughs> happy days. Lay that there. We've got the important monster performance and safety tip book. Lay that there. We have, I don't know what this is, it doesn't look like it's in English. Information for customers and blah blah blah. There. Ooh, this is nice. Oh, glossy. See. see what this does. Once again, more <laughs> shit for us to buy, blah 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 blah. No one really cares. Waste paper. So this is the uh, infamous lead here, as you can see, nicely wrapped up, warning labels and shit like that. <laughs> this is what I was talking to you about, so it's got the minus button, I don't know if you can see that, the minus button there, the plus button there, button in the middle there, and you've got the part of the lead that goes into your iPod, and you've got the part that goes into the headphones, which is that one there. Nicely wrapped up with this sort of like Velcro on every side kind of thing, which is quite cool. That can lay there for a bit. So as you can see, this is the box. It opens up like a book kind of thing, which is really neat actually. To be honest, I don't think, the money is probably for the boxing rather than the actual headphones. Um, here we've got like a, I don't even know what this is. Oh, so this is the manual and warranty. Download the complete manual, blah, 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 off his website. So that's quite neat. So that can just lay with them really. You're not really gonna look through that, are you? And all of that shit goes in this little section of the box there. So, oh, and you get a cleaning cloth with, um, with it as well, because obviously you're going to polish your headphones, not your actual iPod screen. So that's cool. Now for the headphones themselves, they come in a nice little pouch, as you can see, which is quite neat, actually. I quite, I quite like that. I'll probably store some money like a fanny pack, I don't know. You could you decide. <laughs> now let's open up. Now this is the uh, dreaded moment, guys, because obviously I haven't seen it. I haven't touched them till now. Boy, look at that, nicely packed. They're packed quite tight actually. I probably wouldn't be able to repack these, you know. Chinese people, I'm joking. <laughs> anyway, um, these are the headphones that come in a little polystyrene bag, as you can see. And um, that's quite nice actually. I quite like that they're, you know, not open to the public to touch. No one else has touched these but the person who packed them and me. So let's see here. They're quite neat actually. So they snap into place, left and right. Snap into place. Can you see that? Yeah? 
They've got all of the stuff on the top there. Now, the reason why I particularly bought a red pair was I do like the colour, as you can see, red paint. But it also um, is a special edition product red. Now, the proceeds of this goes to a charity. And um, clearly, anything for charity must be good. So I bought into this and I got myself a pair. So on the inside, it says right, it says left for your headphones. And it also tells you what make and model they are. These are the um, high definition solo product red special edition ones. So obviously, get yourself a pair of those. Inside the pouch are um, some more cables, actually. So you also get two headphone leads, which I think are quite neat, actually, because obviously, how annoying is it when you get your iPod and it comes with one lead and one of the headphones pops, breaks, whatever, and then you're screwed. So at least this comes with two. So if you do lose one, then um, you've got a backup. As you can see, the difference is this one's got the controls here and this one doesn't. So that does sort of like let you know that now. But the pouch is quite neat, quite nifty. Definitely be storing all my headphones in that when I'm not using them. And um, what else do we have in the box? I think that's about it, guys. So um, thanks for watching. Any comments, anything, just post a response. And I'd love to hear your views on it. I'm going to plug this into my iPod and try them out. See you later. Whatever. <laughs>